Thank you, lady. That was good. Oh, they are good. We are the having way, a big way, time. By the way, hey, hey, who's Mex County play tonight? I'm Chattanooga City. Chattanooga City. Wow. Mm -hmm. You're going to beat them, aren't you? Yeah. All right. That's the kind of thing we like to know. We're going to win. we got birthdays to celebrate this morning. Well, By the way, if you're just getting up and joining us, we're live from Decatur, Tennessee's brand spanking new Hardee's right here in the heart of Meigs County. I absolutely agree with you, Don. We're having a big time. This is the biggest the biggest time maybe of all time in the Hardee's. Well, and the best breakfast you'll ever find, Oh, right? absolutely. It's I mean, a brand new one, and uh, the people come here by the droves, I hear. The hottest coffee, the tastiest yes. biscuits, the yes. best sausage, yes. the best gravy, yes. the best pancakes. Yes, I agree. <laughs> <laughs> one location my friend, and they do it better than Grandma ever did it, and I'm talking about Hardee's. Now, let's celebrate birthdays throughout the tri-state area as we do that this morning and see if we can award an a, cake, a cake to somebody courtesy of the Federal Bank. Shops I think we should. Nugget. As we celebrate birthdays, and we'll start off with Mark Young. Mark, I don't know what that and means. And <laughs> It could well be. Could be. Happy birthday to you. Teresa Moore is celebrating a 28th birthday. Yes. And Hildred, Hildred yes. Ray, she lives in Cleveland. Her husband says she is 39 plus. I like that. 39 plus. That's like me. That's 29 gonna, and holding and yeah, 39 plus. When I'm 39, I'm going to say I'm plus. I tell you what, I think old T. Randy ought to be our birthday cake winner. We got his picture. You can put it back up there again, Larry, if you can find it. T. Randy and Sally I and absolutely Butch, agree. And they'll get the birthday cake courtesy of the Federal Bank Shops in Chattanooga, and we'll let them all just sit down and enjoy it later today, okay, right? Okay, very good. Back in a couple of minutes from Decatur, Tennessee. After all, it wasn't Todd's fault that he was locked in the trunk of a friend's car. The 16-year-old student at the normal Illinois high school carpools with six buddies. But there's one more buddy than Steve, so one guy rides in the trunk. It was Todd's turn in the boot, but his friends forgot to let him out. Todd was locked in the trunk for only a few minutes before someone heard his calls for help and called the police. But his adventure made him late, and school officials didn't think it was a legitimate excuse. They handed him an unexcused absence for tardiness in the trunk. Another not accepted excuse is my neighbor's dog thought I was a cat and kept me treed. I'm Abby Uther. Kids News, presented with pride by News Channel 9. Here's another way Toyota beats the competition. Resale value. The most honest reflection. Oh, some by thousands. We want to give you the... And it is a little rainy out there. 65 degrees is our temperature northwest. To our radar. Then to get you started. Breakfast. Now in Decatur, that means you drop by your local Hardee's. You can get pancakes or two cinnamon and raisin biscuits or even one of our Rise and Shine sausage biscuits for 99 cents. Not just today, but every day. In Decatur and about every other town around here, folks know when it's time for breakfast, it's time for Hardee's. If you're still up in the air about which new car to buy, consider... 72 at 5 o'clock, and uh, we are going to have some rain for a while today. Might see some breaks this afternoon. Um, and you can see a little clearing from time to time as our heaviest rain seems to be occurring during the first half of this day. That's your weather. This weather brought to you by Walter Jackson Chevrolet Geo in Ringgold, Georgia. We're going to be hearing now from the, the choir that we have assembled here. Shirley, you wanted to introduce someone? Yes, I'd like to introduce you to the uh, president or captain of the Fellowship of Christian Athletes, my daughter, Carmen Jennings, who's the pianist for the group. Yeah, I was over here, and I was like, where is that music coming from? And I come over here, and you have a, I really do have something going on. Uh, tell us a little, little bit about what you do. Well, the fellowship, I'm the captain of the Fellowship of Christian Athletes, and this year we have 103 students who are interested in being in that club, and that's over a fifth of our school. Very good. Well, let's get it started. We'll let them go at it again here. Here they are. Let's go. Would you be free from the burden of sin? There's power in the blood, power in the blood. Would you for evil a victory win? There's wonderful power. Play tonight. City. 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 
win? Yeah, oh yeah. You want to predict the score? Uh, I ain't gonna say it now. now. Win's a win whether it's one point or a hundred. Right? That's right. Way to go, go. Don't mind a little rain in case it does rain? I hope it does. Oh, okay, good. That's what I got uh, attitude. Come on, folks, you gotta stand up. We, yes, 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 yes. Come on, everybody, stand up. We mean no. These, these young people, I understand, are exchange students, am I right? Yeah. From where? Cuneo. Who? Italia. Italia. Italia? That's not close to here, is it? <laughs> How long have you been here? Um, two weeks. Just two weeks? Are you, are you going back before long? No. Oh, you're going to stay here? No, we go back. You go back, <laughs> you go back to, to where? You go back to home, right? Yeah, before to New York. What's been one of the most pleasant experiences about being here? Or unusual, either way. <laughs> What'd you find really weird? I, the way your way your comrades are giggling here. What happened? Um. 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 <laughs> She's just gonna giggle. Well, let me see if I can find somebody else to touch. Thank you for talking to us. You're amazing. Come on, you're next. Come on, folks. Just stand up and come out here and, and let's do this thing. You are. Marcella. It's good to see you. What what happened to you that's embarrassing or or the group? Anything? <laughs> I guess so. Embarrassing or fun? Come on, tell us. I don't know. You don't know what was funny or embarrassing or fun? Yeah. What have you done that's fun? Rafting. <laughs> White water rafting in you the like, local. You like to do that? Yeah. I haven't done that yet because I'm afraid I'll get hurt. <laughs> <laughs> it's no big deal, right? Non lo so, guardi. Mi lascia andare. Not at all. Thank you. Come on up here. I assume you probably, you look like a whitewater rafter. You like to whitewater raft? Down the Okoy? Yeah, I like water. rafting. This, this is difficult because I don't speak their language and they're having difficulty understanding mine, right? <laughs> yes. <laughs> no. Just just a little bit? No, admit it. A whole lot of difficulty understanding me. Who are you? Uh, my name is Fabrizio. I come from Cuneo. Tell me about your home. Mm, my home is a semi detached house. It's uh, not uh, far from uh, to Cuneo, about uh, five kilometers. Uh, I have in my house uh, there are... Uh, Five, uh, five rooms is a, is a nice place. Uh. How did you get to come uh, over here for this exchange program? How? How did you get to come here? What did you have to do to become eligible to come to the States for this exchange program? Is it a competition? No, 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 no competition. Uh, we have, uh, is uh, the third year that our school has organized uh, this uh, exchange with uh, the States. Okay, good. Well, it's good to have you here. Who are we got to get these other folks on? She is still blushing. Why are you, you, you know, blushing? She wants to talk again? Okay, what do you want to say? No, 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 no. Oh, you, she's through and he's going to talk now, right? Who are you? Andrea. Well, can you tell me something embarrassing about her? <laughs> <laughs> to speak here. <laughs> and, uh, stop. Only to speak here. Just like, hurry up and get this off of me, right? Hi, who are you? Alessandro. I am in Italy. Is, is there, is, what's been the biggest difference since you've been here? The food, the people, <laughs> the music, what? The Italian food is better. <laughs> it's better where? Everywhere. Every food is better in Italy. Really? Yes. All of it? Even hamburgers, or do you have hamburgers? We have. <laughs> Hi, who are you? I'm Chiara. How are you today? Uh, mm -hmm. Fine. <laughs> Okay. Thank you, folks. It's a pleasure to have you here, and we certainly hope you enjoy your stay. Do what? Thanks. Yeah. <laughs> Bye. <laughs> she wants to get this out. We'll be back in just a couple of minutes from Decatur, Tennessee. Right, Will? Bill? Uh, Will, Bill. Will, Will, Will Bill. Bill. <laughs> You're speaking that date knees again. <laughs> Everybody at Mullinax Lincoln. We're here. Decatur, Tennessee. 65 degrees. We have rain uh, right now, and um, it's going to be raining even up to uh, the noon hour. Then I think we might see some breaks, but still a chance for some showers later today. Might even see a little sunshine. 65 now, 70 at noon, 72 at 5 o'clock. You know, when there's some rain around, you always have some traffic problems. To so tell us about that, it is Bob Cox, and he works at US 101. Good morning, Bob. Good morning, Bill. No accidents right now. That's the good news. The bad news, the wet streets and the rain overnight have produced standing water, especially on Airport Road and Rossville Boulevard. Keep that in mind this morning as you're traveling to work. And don't forget about the school zones. The posted speed limits are in effect. Tune in traffic on US 101 FM throughout the day. With your morning traffic watch, I'm Bob Cox for News Channel 9. This update was brought to you by Jerry Duncan Chrysler Plymouth Dodge Jeep Eagle. Good people. Lynn, how are you doing this morning? 
fine. Been kind of busy, hasn't it? Yeah. Want to say hi to somebody? Hi to my husband and Amy and Jamie. What's your husband doing? Is he just sitting there at the house? He's getting the kids ready this morning. Well, it's a good thing that he does that, isn't it? Real good She's thing. working hard and she needs the help. Thank you. Nice meeting you. You are? Hi, Donna Nelson. Hi, Donna. Hi. You've got the prettiest smile. You've been well, smiling ever since we got here. Of course. When you work, work at Hardy's, you always smile. <laughs> you want to say hi to some folks? <laughs> oh, just all my family here in Decatur. They're all watching, huh? Of course. Good bunch of family? Oh, yes. Oh, they are? Yeah. Wouldn't trade them? No, oh. not for the world. <laughs> Thank you, Donna. Let me go right quickly over here and let's see if we can get some more folks. We talked to her. Come here. Come here. Come here. Come here. Who are you? Who are you? I'm Sunshine. Hi, Sunshine. <laughs> are you really Sunshine? Yes. Well, say hi to somebody, Sunshine. Hi, hon. Who's hon? My honey. Your honey? My husband. Well, what's his name? Bob. What does he do? He, works at, he works at Storm Manufacturing. Could we embarrass him right now? She rode in on a motorcycle? Did yeah. you really? Yeah. No wonder you're called Sunshine. What do you, what do you ride? Uh, 66 Harley Davidson oh, Sports. Oh, that's the only way to go. Thank <laughs> you very much. Let's go to Bill. He's right behind you there, Harlan, my friend. Harlan, I'm right here, buddy. You know what that was? That was an orbit, buddy. Who are you? Being firm. And you going to school where? Cedar Valley. And are you having a good time today? Yeah. How long is it going to be before you have to get into school today? What time do you go in? 8.15. Want to say hi to anybody? Mm. Nobody you can think of? No. It's okay. Thank you for coming in. Okay? Come on over here. Your name? Judy Moore. And you want to say hi to anybody today? I already did. Well, go ahead, because they didn't hear you, maybe. All right. Mike, my husband. This is my son, Harley. Harley, it's very good to see you, my boy. Say hi. Say hi. Hi, hi, hi. Uh, Harley is just a very shy, kind of like Don Welch, a little shy. Don has a very special guest for us uh, who wants to do some acknowledging. Julia is the lady in charge. That's why we're going to let her have the microphone. She even can outrule Clarence, right? <laughs> sort of. It's hard to do, though. We want to thank you for inviting us to this new Hardee's. Matter of fact, I understand this kind of came about by somebody calling and saying, hey, right. we need a Hardee's in Decatur. Right, right. These people, they, they really wanted a place to come out and eat, and we are so happy to be here. But the thing I wanted to do is really thank the people that put this together, because I just made a few phone calls, and we've had this great turnout. And Shirley Jennings with her football singers, and also Carolyn Wilson that came to promote the, the crowd craft show. It just made it easy. I know it was hard for you getting it, getting the time to talk to everybody, but we're glad to be here and the people in Meigs County are great. We're just glad to be here. You know, that that's one of the great things we can say. This is one of the friendliest places. That's and of course right. that always makes it the people the people of Meigs County make it, don't they? That's right. We and our employees, the people that are working here, everybody knows each other and this is the type of place we like to be. That's great. Well, we're glad you're here. Yeah, we're glad Thank you're you here. very much. Let's find William right over here, young man. Well, I just thought maybe it was time for a, we haven't heard from Clarence in a little bit, and, you know, it is his 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 show, so let's let him do his thing. <laughs> no, I've been occupied back here. <laughs> He's been very busy. Yeah, I've been I, talking. I noticed you spending a lot of time with the female species. You noticed that? <laughs> yeah. Yeah, okay. They was, away, they was asleep back there, and I tried to stay up keep awake. <laughs> Clarence, what would you like to say? I will say this. <laughs> Channel 9, Good Morning Show, had been on two year, day before yesterday. So I think we need to say happy birthday to him and should give him a big hand, all right? Oh. There you go, happy birthday Thank you very to much. Bill. Right. <laughs> hey, we're returning glad to have you people. It's a very nice store up here. We appreciate Julia and her crew. Bye-bye, have a good day. <laughs> Come here a second. I'm leaving, okay. Come here, just a moment. Come here. I don't know. She, she's the one I talked to back there a while <laughs> That's right, ago. but she talks. And what is your name? Brenda. Brenda. <laughs> mm -hmm. She told me every time I go to the store, say hello to Brenda. My never could thank her name. And they call me Edna. Call her. What, what else did I call you? I don't know. Motor mouth, that's right. <laughs> <laughs> thank you, folks. Glad to have you. I just want everyone to know if uh, if Vicky's up and watching, this looks a little bit like my mother, like my my wife's mother, Sue Tate in Humble, Tennessee, and I just want you to know that A she, good mother-in-law, right? Oh, absolutely. The best. <laughs> the very best. Thank you very As much. As we leave you this morning, and we want to thank all the folks here in Decatur and Meigs County for coming by to say hi to us. we still got a lot of cups to give away. We'll be here through about 8.30. We want to see you. Thank to, thanks a lot to Mark, uh, to Ed. I don't know where they are. They're around serving, we hope, right? <laughs> they, well, there's enough people, too. I mean, we have... It's a Shadow